Hi, this is Joey from ESC Plus, and I am here at Donsk Melody Grand Prix with Leonora. Hello. Hello. Uh, so I was looking a little bit about your background in sports. Has all the training that you've had to do over the years helped with preparation for Donsk Melody Grand Prix? Mm, yes, I think. Because when you do sports on like a, a high level, you really learn something about discipline. So. And you really want to get your, your s things very um, uh, good <laughs> when you want to get your things together, like, yeah. So there's a lot of routine in in the sports preparation as well, I'm sure, as as performing. Yes, definitely. So let's talk a little bit about the song, Love is Forever. Mm -hmm. uh, what is the meaning for you in, in within the song? Well... You can say that the title says a lot about the, the yeah. message in the song, that love is forever and for everyone. And uh, yeah, it, it, it's something that is between people in different ways and can be one to one. It can be like a m in a broader sense, um, that a thing that unites people. Yeah, I, th I think that that's a message that will will be very Eurovision friendly. Uh, it'll it's something that I think fans are responding to already online uh, you know in Denmark and also internationally that the fact that you've got the multiple languages within the lyrics is also something that I think is resonating what was the idea who came up with the idea to do that well, that was the songwriters yeah. I wasn't a part of writing the song but I'm really happy about it yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> and of course it's um, we think we've it was supposed to have some spice in it, that song, so... And this felt like a really natural way to to spice the song up and, and include more, as many people as possible and like be multicultural in a way, like include everyone, yeah. Yeah, I, I, think, it's, I think it's beautiful. Um, last thing would be, what are some of your favorite Eurovision winners? You've been compared to a couple and I'm just curious uh <laughs> well, if you have a favorite uh I think my favorite is um s uh, the Portuguese one the one one Salvador uh, yeah. oh, I'm not surprised because uh your song has a lot of elements of you know a love song and his his song was too so yeah, I think it sounds vintage in an yeah. awesome way yeah. timeless yeah well good luck and uh thanks for taking the time to to talk to us. Thank you very much. I'm gonna just